Hey guys, welcome back to Digimon. I have made a discovery. I have made an awesome discovery. If we go to settings, we can actually rename them. We can actually give them nicknames. How fantastic is that? We can actually nickname them. That's cool. I love it. If you guys have any name suggestions, please feel free to put them in the comments below and I will pick them out and plop them onto the, our Digimon friends. Investigation, they found a case. Okay, quiz time. What is the name of the most important machine? Enveloping your head. What? A very dangerous sword. A digivice. A digiline terminal. Uh, we found a case as well, apparently. That's awesome. Uh, let's head back to the farm. So, holy shit, we can name these guys. In the comments below, put what Digimon and then a name. And I will just pick at random. I'll pick like, you know, my first ones I see, I'll put on there. That'd be great. Uh, I would like I would like to say only name one Digimon each, but at the same time, we're gonna get a lot of different Digimon. And I don't think many people are gonna be excited to do that. So let me know. We'll, we'll see, but we'll, you know, just do it. Let me know. Uh, train. Let's do a leisure course. Uh, leisure course of training because they don't because they don't want the cam to go down. So I want you to have more cam. Here you go. Cam plus one. Fantastic. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, he loves it. Okay, that's great. What is your cam now? Your cam is now three percent. Jesus, we need to. That's ridiculous. Uh, oh no. Here we go. Uh, farm expansion. Update. Whoa! Look at that! Oh, cool! Oh my god! Increase the quality of items made in development. Increase the amount of HP it has through training. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, cool! Look, like little things. Oh, what was that? Developer know-how. All right, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Oh, it's fantastic! Look at that. All right, let's try it. Develop. Here's a thousand yen, guys. Let's see what you got. Oh, that's cool. Oh, we're finding out so much about this game today. Talk about knowing the basics. All right. Let us go into here. Oh, no, wait. They found a case for us, didn't they? Let's have a look. What new case was added? What was this? Uh, Woodmon's property. Okay. Kalu level two. I need to look for something precious I dropped at Kalu level two. All right. Start investigation. We'll do that at the same time. We'll go to the entrance first. See if we can pick up our new main case. Uh, there we go. We'll go Kaloon 2 first. We'll finish this one. Then we'll go... Oh, hello, Woodman. Woodman, hello. Nice to meet you, Detective. I'm the one who fired this case of your office. I'll get straight to the point. I lost my precious thing the other day, and it's not good. Not good at all. I think I probably fell out somewhere around Kaloon level 2. That's my guess. If you could find it for me, I would repay you in kind. We should look at a detective. Uh, okay, wood guy. Oh, he looks kind of cool. I like wood one. He's a fun kind of wood one. All right. So we have no idea where it's going to be. It's just going to be on the floor somewhere. It's just a shining piece of crap. We're back in Kaloon level two. I'm sorry if these things aren't as interesting as the main story because that ghost thing was hella interesting. It was so cool. It was so. Was that it? Uh, okay, we can make one of those now, and we can uh, either eat you, feed him to someone or eat him. Wait, we can either feed him to someone or eat him. We can either feed him to somebody or keep him. Uh, Debbie, 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 one level four now. That's awesome. Uh, was that it? Am I blind? Oh, I guess that wasn't it. I thought I found it, and I was like, oh, there it is. But no. 
I was incorrect. Okay, so once again, it's probably in the stage up ahead. All the oops, all these are obviously designed just to give you experience points and give you uh, cyber sleuth points. You know, all that stuff, which is not a bad, it's not a bad game design, but it's. That is definitely the reason why we're doing this. And we have to do it because we want to keep up to leveled. We want to be leveled up to the correct level, don't we? Oh. I really wish that more things would come out in the newer areas. But I suppose they're all Digimon that we can feed. It's all data, isn't it, that we can give to other, other Digimon. There you go. It's also Devi Devi Mon's level up, so that's very good. Oh, hello. Too bad the actual Digivice. Oh, I fucking knew it was Digivice. But I was like, why would that be in my head? Wait, was that the actual question? I need to check it now. Oh, Tapos. That's what uh, evolved into our Seed Oh, fucking hell. That was overkill. <laughs> That was very much overkill. That spiky box ain't got shit on me. Right, okay. Did Ikakuman just level? That's way five. Ikakuman is getting there. He's almost Whalemon territory. He needs a few more stat increases though. But I think he's uh, he's getting quite close. I'm very excited for that. Very excited to see our Ikakumon become a whale mod. That'd be badass. Whale one's cool, man. It's a cool Digimon. Oh dear. More, more of these little fishy guys, which is good. It's all good. Tear beats spiky. Super effective. Look at that. Demi Demi mod, level 7 now. Which is fantastic. He needs to be level 15, I think, for us to get a Devimon. Well, I think we'll go for the one below him. Just because I think that would be the better situation. I'll explain it when we get back to a Digi Lab. Because if it's not what we think it is, or not something that we like, then we can just revert it, right? Because we're not using him, we're just having him in our party. But I want to know what that Digimon is. I'm desperate to know. Uh, have you guys seen a special thing? A woodman dropped it somewhere. Oh, more tadpoles. There we go. We got it. <laughs> we got our, got our thing. Preferably prefer some Beomons or whatever now. But, uh, whatevs. Oh, we even got a medal. Shit, man. We need to go hand in a bunch of medals. So I think we've, that guy's probably going to give us a lot of yen for all those medalies, that things that we got. What the fuck is that? What even is? Oh. That's dead now. What the fuck was it? Let's have a look. Uh, where do we where do we look? Where the fuck? Field guide. Here we go. It's not on here. Oh, there it is. It's a Lalamon. A Lalamon, huh? Alright. Beat him on! Yeah, he's cool. The Growlmon. Oh, we there. oh my god, there's so many Digimon! Look how many there is! Yeah, look at that thing. Machine Dramon. That's what we want. We want a Machine Dramon. When Gardramon becomes a Machine Dramon, then we'll take him out and put him in our party. Hell to the yes. Oh, there it is. Is that it? That flashing little light? Did 
towards the property. Yeah, I think that's it. I think that's good. There's a thing there we could go into. I don't think we can get back to the other area through there, though. Let's just nip up ahead, just real, real quick. And then we'll use a uh, teleport thing to teleport back. I think that's probably probably the quickest way about going about it. Yeah, did it. Victory. Yokomon medal. Fantastic. Alright, what have we got in here? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I was hoping there'd be like some treasure or something on the floor, something back in this area, but nah. Nothing whatsoever. We're gonna have to buy some more of these exports, I think. But I think I think exporting back is probably very good. It's it saves us so much time and effort. Look, there we go. Didn't precious thing, run it, I doubt I'd really easy. Okay, great, thanks, bye. Thanks for doing all this, detective. You're welcome, woman. See you later, buddy. Uh, go to Digilab. Yes, please, real quick. Just so I can show you guys what I mean. Uh, Digivolve. Uh, he, this guy is a couple of levels off. I think we're gonna go with Bakuman. Cause I, I, I don't really know. Cause this thing, I don't remember what it Digivolves into, but I think it Digivolves into that weird spider thing, which I don't like. I think it's dumb. So it's all very wiry still, isn't it? So I think we're gonna go with the Bakuman. Cause I, I like the ghost one. That's cool. And Devimon, this is the one that I was looking at. This one down here. Oops, bugger. Like, this one digivolves into that, which would be very cool. Devimon is badass. But this one as well. I don't know what this one is. So I think we'll digivolve into this one and see what it is. If it's shit and we hate it, then we can revert back to Devimon and then go for a dev Devilmon. A Devimon. That's what we'll do. I think that's the best way to do it, right? It's the best way to do it. And Gajamon, I don't really know which one we need to do to make to find a machine drum on, but we'll get in there. We'll get in there. Gumbamon is still not quite ready to do that. He can do any of these though. He can do anything. He can become anything he wants but a Garurumon because of his cab. So you guys let me know. If we want to see a Garurumon then we will, but maybe you guys want to see like what this thing is or what the poop mod is, you know? There's plenty of different things. Maybe digivolving him, then de digivolving him would increase his cam. Would that help? You think? Oh, here we go. Let's uh, hatch all these guys. Yep. Yep. There we go. A weird tadpole mod. Yep. And a Yoko mod. Go. And now, who do we want to feed that to, though? Because all that stuff can be fed. We don't want any, any of this. Uh, we can feed it to him. Uh, that might get it. No, it's not going to get him. It's not going to get him where we want him to be. Uh, Devimon, I guess. No, 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 no. Don't feed it to Devimon. We want to feed them to Devimon. Uh, that goes to level 11. Kind of shit in it. Do we want to see what else the uh, thing can digivolve into? Let's have a look. Okay. One on one. You can digivolve into whatever that is. Whatever that is. Oh my god, is that that weird, like, punching dog thing? Oh, I think it is. Should we try and get the weird punching dog thing? What can you. How much of this can you take? Get you to level 7. Oh, shit, we didn't even look at what these needs to be. What do you need to be? You need to be level 9. Cam. Oh, fucking Cam again. It's just the worst. Shit it out. Alright. Uh... Yokomon, Beomon. What do these guys go into? These, these guys could probably see some pretty cool things too. Yeah, we evolved him into a Siege Mob, but we could make him into a weird thing. We can make him into a poop. Wanna make him into a poop? Level 12. Give him level 12. Did you want me into a poo poo? 
See where the poo poo goes? Alright, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Alright, you, you move into the digi farm because you're going to become a poo poo mod. Just out of curiosity. That's the only reason he's joining the digi farm. For us to make him a poop and see what happens. Science. That's that's why he's going there. For science. See you later, Wimbun. Thanks for the case, buddy. Alright, let's head to the entrance. So apparently the view is splendid. Ah, there you go, up there. See it? Yeah, you do. Oh, shop. Should we have a look? Welcome. Bye. What have you got? Change Dig Digimon's personality to Builder. To Searcher. I don't know what they do. Uh, let me know, please. That's right. <laughs> I'm using you guys as a source of information for everything. But you know what? It's fine because you've... Oh, what is this? There's an anomalous post on the Digiline. Stop looking at me. No reply. Yeah, we got another case from the Octocult Cult Club. This one looks personal though. I think those guys might have taken a uh, liking to us. Give us a deal with a strange, unusual line of work. Oh god, no, not again. Can we just like turn the fuck off? Go see an exorcist or something? I'm not, I don't, oh. Doing so that it gets strange, unusual things to do in our lives. So that was really, hee <laughs> hee. Oh god. Oh. But mom, I swear there's something there. I just found it. Sweetie, look behind you and check for yourself. See, nothing there. Now don't worry about it. Hey, little girl. But mom, I swear, there's something there. Oh, how sweet. Okay. Uh, what are these? We can't go through here. Okay, we're leaving. We're leaving here. We're going to hand in that side quest. And then we are going to do this new cultist bollocks. Oh, fuck it out. It's going to be scary. Hello. Hi, hi. Hey. Alright. Let's go to another area and get the hell out of here. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Log out. Yes, please. I'm back. Yep, done. Nice. Oh, yeah. Maybe basic, but we did it, right? Alright. Everyone, all our Digimon are happy and healthy. Let's save the game, because I don't think I've saved in a little while. There we go. And now let's accept the next creepy-ass quest. Nightmare Eater. Oh, fantastic. This one sounds lovely. Aha, uh -huh. Research Club Eden. Place Eden, okay. My Digiline is weird. It keeps transmitting without doing anything. Alright. Nice to see you again. What brings you here by yourself? Uh, well, I think I might have got caught up in a cybercrime. Cybercrime? Did you go to the police? I can't really. There's something supernatural elements involved, I think. I understand. You made the right choice coming to us. Alright, give us the details. Okay, take a look at this. This is my log and digiline. Alright, let's see what you've got. Sigh, should I go to the club tomorrow? They claim to do research, but all they really do is hang out and talk. The only club because everyone has similar interests. I should probably enroll in something a little more serious. Go to that too. And I could really use a hot, manly boyfriend too. Oh my gosh, did I just write that heart. Uh, what's so special about this? Keep going, you'll understand why. Could Kenji have a crush on my... Lol, 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 no way. She has a one-track mind. She has to think of anything else but the Ossicult core staff. Okay, does that guy even have eyes on straight? He's such an ass. He's a real hottie right in front of him. I can't take his eyes off me, me for even a second to notice it. Maybe I should seduce him. He, 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 ha. Maybe I've got the goods. I'd give him a peek anytime. 
Ooh, how do I put this? Your posts aren't pulling any punches here. Put my personal op opinion aside. I otherwise don't see anything wrong with them. They look normal to me. The thing is, I didn't write that stuff. What? It just randomly showed up. They freaked me out so badly I deleted them. Uh, I hear you. That doesn't... Then doesn't that mean your account is probably just hacked? Some 2-bit hacker probably did it to screw with you. Or maybe your computer is infected with a... No, is isn't anything like that. Uh, I think this is where that supernatural part you mentioned factors in then. Yeah. Wasn't those who wrote those posts and put them online, but that's how I feel. What you see written there and stuff like that, I think I, I think about, but don't express out loud. Okay, I get you. The stuff that's hard to share with any other club members, basically. Right. Oh, seeing that you're a, uh, in the Octocult Club. What, what a name for a club. Jesus Christ. I'm sure... <laughs> I'm sure you know about own Oji boards and whatnot, right? Your hands move against your will. Your hands move against your will, sending you messages... From the spirit world, something like that. Could that possibly be happening to you? Looking at the post times on your log, those messages went out dead at night. You should have been long sound asleep by that point. Okay, then what? In the late 18... 1800s, fucking hell, okay, there was, a, there was an epidemic by the name of... An academic. An academic, not an epidemic. Epidemic is something completely different. An epidemic by the name of Inro Ilu, okay, who posted these sorts of things. Okay. Come from having multiple cells. You mean the man who came up with the mystery studies, right? Showing his work off in the club. Hold on, are you saying I have a spirit, a split personality? The politically correct term for that would fucking hell <laughs> this is ridiculous identity disorder actually oh well okay then <laughs> since those posts without a night without even realizing it that would explain it oh my fucking god oh god well we've solved your issue so you can leave now before it gets really fucking creepy that's not it huh this is because of some mental issue here look at this just try and find me. This was just now posted onto your account. It re oh, I see. We had things so didn't we? We looked at that thing and it was like, uh... Stop staring at me. To the culprit, I'm a detective who's taken up the back of this case. Know that we will track you down and uncover your identity. No matter who or where you are, you cannot hide forever. You've been warned. Well, conversation unfolds online as as you and I were talking whilst you weren't touching any terminals. That means you're not the one behind those posts, let alone any mental disorder of yours. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, you have some mental disorders of yours, but it's not to do with any of those. Whoever's behind it is just a dumb troll. Alright. Again, the fake wanderer or someone trying to make this look like a mystical as it really is. What a fucking asshole. Alright, let's go search for this guy. Facts about yourself. Facts as much as I know I think I feel really... You were locked into Eden before you fell asleep? Yes, I do that every night. Gotcha, then I was... <laughs> gotcha, that's the year. We've solved the crime. <laughs> it's all to do with Eden. And the way I see it, I bet the culprit's been snooping around a hacked into your memory data in Eden. You can do that sort of thing in Eden? Well, not literally, at least not that you're lone wolfing if you're a hacker here. God, are you a hacker? Are you hacked? Have you hacked other things, the supernatural things, huh? Don't sweat it for now, just log into Eden tonight like you normally would. I'll have my assistants waiting for you in the lobby. Alright, but what do you actually plan on doing? Oh, let's just say fox hunting you. 
So we're going to wait for him to show up, and then we're going to get our Digimon to eat him. Oh, I'm already here. Okay. Still not here yet. Here's hoping he's at the side that was to come. Oh, I had Makuna lay down her uh, decoy. The corporate type of person I suspect, they will definitely go for it. Okay. Safe guess to say that they're going to log into Eden tonight. Once, once they're in position, it's all a matter of approaching them. Should be a problem either. That's because Pete's going to be working with us. Who? Oh, how's it going? Long time no see. Thanks again for what you did back in the AC stuff. Oh yeah. Hey Pete, how's it going? I had Pete here take a look at those posts the hacker wrote so he could learn their scent. Oh my god, really? Yep, turns out those messages had traces of Digimon on them. Can't fool me. Oh my god, are you like, like a detective Digimon now? Are you just like a part of our crew? But of course that's why I brought you on board. This is cool, work as a real life detective. I feel like a real boy wonder here. Alright, you've got an M on your head when you begin with a W, so you're not that much of a wonder, are you? Ah, uh, what do you know, the boy wonder is really... Hey, I'm here, sorry to keep you waiting. Did like you asked, posted the message on my Digiline, but... Am I really going to be okay doing that? You're curious what she wrote, aren't you? That's fine, I'll tell you. She confessed her love to the hacker and also mentioned that she really wanted to meet him. Uh, what? A real brilliant ploy on our part. But again, this guy thinks his hacking skills are hot stuff. So, like, this guy gets hacked. This, this guy hacks her, uh, does all this shit, and now she's like, Oh, I love you, hacker. I love you so much. And the hacker's like, oh yeah, she loves me. I'm gonna. How did? How would he not see that as a fucking like ploy? How would he not figure that out? I smell him. He's close by. Good. It's time to go hunting. Go investigate the surrounding area. And get this person out of the foxhole. All right. We have mail. Shaking palm trees makes fruitful. I love them, but I can't take too much. Is, uh, is there something? Is that right? I wonder if humans could eat those fruits too. Other, uh, still nothing. I would have thought that message would have been in there. Stop looking at me. Uh, right, okay. You know what? We're gonna stop it there. That's right. What a fucking asshole. For me, it's not that big of a deal because I get to do it right now. But you guys have to wait till tomorrow. <laughs> All right, no, we're gonna go. We're gonna log off here. We're gonna log off. We're gonna stop here. Thanks so much for watching. Because I don't want it to be another stupid long episode, and we're only halfway through this deal. So I will see you guys next time when we find out who is this hacking. Is it that guy? That little guy looks quite suspicious. It could possibly be that guy, or it could be a horrible Digimon, or it could be a poop. I think it's a poop because they're like pervy mod. They're like pervy creatures, right? So definitely gonna be a poop. And I will see you guys next time when we finally figure out the case of. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what this case is. But we, we're going to figure it out. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.